Hi gals, welcome back to another episode of Zero Waste Closet. So this week I wanna give you a really practical video for just those hot summer days. Maybe you're just feeling kinda of lazy, maybe you're feeling a little unmotivated, and you still wanna leave the house looking great, but it's just trying to find the energy to put together an awesome outfit. That energy just isn't available to you. I get it. If you live in Arizona, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Sometimes when it's like 110 out, you're just like, ugh, but you still wanna look cute. So I have come up with five outfit formulas that are kind of my personal go-to outfit formulas when I just don't know what to wear. And what I love about formulas is it doesn't have to be specifically the pieces I'm gonna show you. Although if you guys love these pieces, you know they're always here at Chill Boutique. But these are just ideas. So you can follow these formulas using what you already have in your own closet. So let's go ahead and look at five different different ways of combining pieces that I just find work for me every time. This first look I find to be such an easy go-to formula for myself and this is like a year-round go-to formula for me. I take a pair of joggers in the warmer months. It's going to be linen joggers like these ones from Urban Daisy and I take them to another level up a little bit in elegance by adding a platform sandal with them and then on the top half a lot of people aren't quite sure what to do with joggers. I think the easiest thing to do is just take an oversized shirt and half tuck it in the front and let it hang loose in the back and that way it doesn't draw all the attention to the waistline at, versus having the whole thing tucked in and you could do something like this that covers the elbows or if that's just a little too hot for you too much coverage then an oversized flowy tank top will do the same trick this second look takes almost no effort in my opinion. So here I take a short denim skirt. You could easily substitute shorts if you wish. And then I pop over the top a tank with the Riley shirt on top. Any button down shirt will do, although you guys know I love the Riley because it's in Tencel, which is a wonderful, very cool to the touch fabric for summertime. And I just tie it at the waist and all of a sudden it's just a very chic look that took no energy. Then I pop on a cute, sneaker to boot. So I've got the OTBT sneakers here, a little platform sneaker in gold. So it's just a little pop of fun to add some interest to the outfit. And then maybe a colorful purse like this one here from Consuela. And I feel super chic and just super easy. This third look is one that you could get so many different looks out of using, I am predicting, things you already have in your closet. So I take white jeans, again, any jeans will do, put a tank underneath and take a button down shirt and just wear it over the top. You could definitely tie it at the waist like I'm doing here, or the easiest thing in the world is just to undo it and leave it open, thrown over the top. And it has a very laid back and yet elegant look. And then on the bottom, them. could do a platform slide like these from OTBT, uh, maybe a little straw hat just to add some summer to it. And if you wanted to elevate it, go out to dinner, throw on a higher platform shoe, even a heel, or you could wear sneakers during the day. This is very, very versatile and very easy to replicate. If you guys have been with me for a while, then you know this fourth outfit formula is one I love to pull out. So I simply take a pair of shorts, a tank top, and throw some form of kimono over the top. I love maintaining a handful of kimonos in my closet just because they're so light and easy and they add so much elegance to an otherwise really basic outfit. So here I have on shorts from Just Black Denim, a nice colorful tank, my kimono, and then to take it up a notch. I elevate it with some high wedges from OTBT, nice little bag from Consuela, and I feel really pulled together here. And last but not least is the kind of one and done outfit formula. So I love a good maxi dress during the summer. You could easily substitute a sleeveless romper here. And then for a little added style and kind of the effect of a waistline, I take a shirt like the Riley, any button down shirt, wear it in chambray here, tie it at the waist, and it just gives it ad added style. It gives me some arm coverage. I pair it back to cowboy boots, but you could easily sub in if it's really hot outside, some leather sandals, or even a cute pair of little fashion 
fashion sneakers would do the trick. Gals, I hope this made life a little bit simpler for you going forward when it comes to getting dressed, especially in the summertime. And we will revisit this topic as the weather turns cooler when fall is with us. So if you guys have any ideas, thoughts, questions, always feel free to email me at lisa at shopchillstyle.com. Of course, you know I love it when you drop your comments in the comment section below. Share it with your community here. And if you guys would like to shop for any of these pieces or just peruse our new arrivals, please jump on to our website at www.shopchillstyle.com. Of course, you know we love it when you come and visit us in person here at Chill Boutique in Fountain Hills if you're lucky enough to be in Arizona or visiting the area. If you guys like this week's video, please make sure to give it a thumbs up. And of course, if you haven't already, make sure to go ahead and subscribe to this YouTube channel, Zero Waste Closet. That way you guys get notifications whenever new videos come out. Gals, hope you're having a great start to your summer and can't wait to see you in the next one.